that you are not going to ruin for me. I don't have time to sit here and listen to nonsense. There's an ambulance right behind me. I can just I grab that. Fuck. And then I just go fucking tell him. I punch him in the face. I don't care. Yeah, I, I need to get mad. Come on. Is it my fault? Nothing is your fault. You don't do Is anything. it my fault? You don't do Wasn't anything. we supposed to be doing shit yesterday? Come on. Get mad, Harold. Let's get back down to it. That could have very easily been here. Uh, but I won't do that. You know why? Because I love you. You know why else? Because Paul's a dead motherfucker. If you teach you stay in there. Your plan failed. So. I don't really give a fuck what your plans are with your daughter. That's between you and your daughter. Now we're going to talk. me all morning. Torture, you just uh, tortured all me all morning. Did all you I hear did. how I was? All I did is speak to you. Did you hear how I was? And, you and I begged you to stop. And you refused medical treatment. Begged you to stop. You refused medical I treatment. I begged you to stop. And I did not. Last I checked, no ambulance came up and I refused anything. You thought your ass was going to be in trouble. You stopped answering the phone. I'm gonna be in trouble. I didn't do anything. I got it all. I don't care what you have. You called me 212 times. I never called your phone once. Yeah, yeah. You kept texting. I sure me. did. You because you left me in a place where I have all my shit. It's under <coughs> your fucking name. You're gonna call me, give me shit. Tell them they're gonna tell me to get the fuck out. I got nowhere to go. You took advantage of me. Number one. Number two. Tortured me. Got me to say whatever you wanted me to say just so we could end it, and then you didn't end it. You st- it just continued for two or three more hours. I didn't do anything. Knowing how I was. Say anything I wanted you knowing to say. Knowing how I was. You told me to take responsibility. That's exactly what you said. Yeah, take responsibility. And I did. Okay. And not only for one, but for everything over the six yeah. months. Yeah. Come on, now I'm starting to get my wits about me. This is what you've done. What you've done is called bullying. I'm not bullying you. If something happens to me, and I've been having a lot of chest pain lately. And you refuse to go to the doctor, so that's on you. And yeah, but it also doesn't help this and the bullying. If I tell you to stop, no means no. I did stop. Just like rape. Didn't answer my no phone. No means no. Didn't answer my phone, didn't talk to you. No. If I'm bullying you so bad, why do you consistently text messages? Because me I have no choice. I didn't do anything bad enough to 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 get that from you. You didn't threaten me, run down a hall, tell me you were gonna beat the shit out of me, okay. walk backwards, follow right. me to an elevator, okay. steal my wallet out of my car, okay. and okay. I left to get away from you. Okay. But yet you call me nonstop okay. to come now back when you to talk you. Talk to a cop. When you talk to a cop, nothing about that is illegal unless I touch you. Really? I can just tell them you hit me the other day because you did. You got to prove. There's got to be a mark. Bruises popping up here. Bruises hey, popping up here. That can't, that you can't prove that one. Mm-hmm. The bruise on my chest from be where fresh, I need. Fresh, fresh, fresh. And you would have had to have called immediately or else. Bye. Okay. I know how it works, Dean. Oh, the we're eye to eye here. If 
my office still stands. <coughs> my alpha being Watch it all here and let it go. Yeah, I'm not willing to do that. Well, then, what are you willing to do? What's your counter offer? I'm calling Paul. I'm killing Paul. I'm telling Paul. This. I'll do I'm whatever I have video. to do because you no longer have control over me at all. I never had control. And I don't want the control over you, and I don't want to have to do anything. But now you're going to have to see reason. I don't want to use anything. I don't want to do anything. I don't want any of that shit. I don't want anything to do with that shit. All you've done for six months. And I didn't do anything that I said I was going to do. Which is not illegal. <laughs> I've been through the system a time or two. I know what's in the system. I know. As long as you are threatening me, intimidating me, using methods to I don't to even want to do all those you're things. Happy. I don't even want to do any of those things. Who wants somebody that's with them under I the don't, concept of fear? I don't want it at all. You want to consistently scare me to keep no, me around? No, baby, I don't want to scare you. Mm -hmm. Mama, mama, I don't want to scare you. Right. I don't. That's why you did that yesterday and the day before what, that, what the day before that, about? the day before that, and just now on the phone and whatnot. What do you mean? What did I do on the phone? I'm emailing Paul, I'm calling my sister. I don't even know half of the shit that I said in the past trouble. 30 minutes. I'm going to minutes. tell him this, I'm going to tell him that. But I'm I do know. Videos. I made videos, they're going out. I do know you can get a lot of trouble. Whatever, then get me in trouble. I Fucking don't call get somebody. You in trouble. I want you to. Get me in trouble. trouble. Do it. I don't want God, you to. God, I'm going to call when I'm alone on my own to tell them that I bullied you and you have so much to tell them about me bullying you. Yeah. To please arrest me. Get me in trouble. Please. Fucking do it. It would, be a, if I have to. it would be a vacation for me to go to jail for a day or two. Yeah, all you do is eat pussy and you get cornrows. Yeah, there. exactly. It would be fucking ideal. Giving back, but you I didn't even me. fucking start that shit yesterday. Oh, okay. You started that shit. <coughs> you promised me you wouldn't fight. Yeah, I said one or two things, and it was like over and done in the minute it happened, and then an hour later, you want to start freaking out and screaming at me and calling me names and treating <coughs> Did me you like even get shit. your wallet from the front desk? No, I don't give a shit about my wallet. As far as, I'm, as far as I'm concerned, you stole my wallet. It's at the front desk. That's where I put it. You, I don't what? care. You Drive back. You stole my wallet out of my Drive car. Back. Nope. We're going to get it. Babe, your ID and shit's in there. I don't care. We're going to get it right now. No, I already called them yesterday, told them to stick it in the mail. It's already been put in the mail. Why are we here? Because I'm not going to drive around in circles. I have plans with my kid, and I plan your on. Your plans change. might be fucking totally fucked up. No. Now. Nope. You told me I have I a plan. I can't leave this car. I have a plan. That's what you said. I can't leave. No, I have a plan for us. I'm not doing it for you. Or you. I'm doing it for us. And sorry, there's a bad time to make fucking plans. You've seen how we're one day out. It's not my problem. So, not me, Kimo Sabi. We better figure it out. My plan was, why don't Paul go stay somewhere else? Then you can stay in the house. He go stay somewhere else. A hotel. A friend's house. Anywhere but the house. Because it's his house, and I'm the one with family, and I'm the one that leaves. But you're also the one taking care of everything anyway. Yeah, and when he's there, he takes care of everything. So we need to figure out where we're going for three days. This is not going anywhere with you. So you are. You are. Because even through that thick ass fucking stubborn 
stuck up fucking bitch ass brain that you got. You love me, Dina. You do. Look at me. You love me. You do. You need to stop being so fucking mean to me, man. You really do. Yeah, that's exactly what you did though. My shit lasted, how long did my shit last? Maybe 10 minutes. You did it all night. All day. To the no, point my where left, I am collapsing no, on the ground. My shit left you alone, but that's called bullying. Me leaving you alone is called oh, you bullying. you leave me alone. Maybe you should go read some of the shit. Maybe you should read some of the shit you wrote. A lot of it, I don't even know what it, I don't even know. That's the easy way out, just to say, I was so fucked up, I don't know what I said. I wasn't fucked up. It doesn't up. count, because I am not on any kind of drugs It doesn't count, because I don't know what I said. I'm not on any kind of drugs or anything. That's I'm completely ex- sober that's, right that's, now. That's your excuse for everything. I don't know what I did in February, because I was on pills. I don't know what I did last uh, yeah. night, because I'm emotionally in February, I, I don't remember two full right. fucking days. That's what I'm going to start saying. I'm going to start taking pills again, so I can say I don't know what I said. You just want to start taking pills again. Yeah. That's fine, go ahead. So I can just use the excuse. You can't bitch at me. Right, so I can just use the excuse that I don't know what I did. And then it'll all just be fine because I don't know what I did. At the end of the day, you know, all these motherfuckers like my mom and Margaret and I guess you. But you did it for different reasons because you stuck around still after. Everyone else filed their shit. You still stuck around. But. Because I'm the idiot. But all the. I'll never say that to me. Showed me love, and I told you many times now. If you showed me love, 
Like you're supposed to show me love. I see it instant. Yeah. Don't I deserve that? Don't I deserve that? And don't I deserve it from you? The love of my life? You just a bully. So you were today. You better call your sister. I don't need to call her. Oh, that's right, because she's not ever fucking there for you. That's no, right. No, but she's all about cops and shit. Good for her. She loves you. Good for her. But the point of the matter is, I don't, I don't, I just don't, I don't want, I want us to fucking be squashed and over. You can't fucking treat me how you treat me. You can't treat me how you treat me. I understand that, but I don't do it to you for days. I do it to you for maybe, maybe, maybe you'll get an hour. I don't care. I never threaten you with physical violence. No, because you know physical violence don't bother me. You can't hurt me. There you go. You just made a point. But yet, you want to take the woman you love. Love so much. I don't want to, or I would. That has been beaten (laughs) down and treated like shit and controlled. Forever, and you want to do the I same don't want to, fucking thing. But I would if that's what I wanted to do. Yeah. I would have beat you down as soon as we got in this fucking car just now. If that's what you I wanted to do. Harold? If I wanted revenge for everything, anymore. listen. I don't care listen anymore. to me. If I just wanted revenge for everything you just done to me, I just could have got it tenfold. But the difference is? I don't want it. I don't care anymore. I don't want it. The difference is, I don't care I don't anymore. want it. That's and, the difference. when I stop caring? Are you going to be a trick asshole? No, I'm a trick asshole. I'm asking you, is that what you're going to be? Because that's what people who don't care are. That's what people who lie and say, oh yeah, the love of my life, and then treat them like they're, they're worse than Paul. You would never treat Paul like that. No, Harold, I can only take so much before something clicks and switches well, in I my brain. I can only take so much, especially broken promises and lies. That's the two quickest ways to get me and you've fired done, up. And you've done both to me. Fired up? I've done what? Both. Broken promises and lies. No. What promise did I break? Maybe I promise I will never hurt you. I will never scare you like that again. Ever. And then you do it again. Lies. You're so fucking incoherent and you can't talk and you're dying from a fucking heart attack. But you need food and you need a drink and you have no problem then coming down and loading the car. And then you have no problem sitting here talking to me coherently now. That's because you're pissing me off. Miss fucking hypochondriac medical... Miss Hypercontract Medical Queen knows exactly how it works. And when I've been in the hospital I with mass chest pain and feel like I'm dying, I don't want to eat, drink, talk to anybody, look at hey, anybody. I just want to lay there and feel like I'm fucking dying. I don't want to fucking it. lay there at all. I don't want to be in a hospital <laughs> at all. If that fucking ambulance tried to kill me and fucking take me out of this truck, I'll punch him in the fucking face. I don't care how sick I am. If I refuse medical treatment, you get the fuck away from me. Old lesbians. Okay.
We don't have plan? to do anything right now. I don't have any plans. We are going to come up with plans. I told you my plan. <laughs> 